guys welcome back to my channel today i'm gonna unboxing this keyboard and lots of other thing that i will show you later on but then i'm not gonna say unboxing because i already opened it for like two to three three two blah, 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 blah. <laughs> for two to three days okay dah dua tiga hari i dah buat benda ni okay so basically i've been using this one for that much there is the thing that i like and the thing that i dislike i will show you first of all this is so freaking cute so much cute i know right and the sound are so nice also every uh, every keyboard button sound like this except for this one this is so bad i know it's so suck and i hate it also and if you want to make it like a little bit taller just like always go from the behind and then yeah oh my god i'm so sorry it's a new one also what did i do so there you go but then if i do it like this i cannot put it inside my um table of table kind of so Anytime I want to put it inside, I have to close the back of the holder kind of thing So that I, will, I can put it inside and there will be not really much dust getting inside the keyboard Oh yeah, that's the thing I want to talk about It's quite hard to remove the keyboard by the way Like, maybe you have to get some uh, That removing keyboard thing like I don't remember the name for that tool like you can pick it up like that you know because to clean the dust it's quite hard maybe you have to find a new brush uh, and also you can get a blower I would prefer it's a blower to be honest you know what I'm using um a cold hair dryer but I will not recommend that one your keyboard gonna broke or something just for once because i have to clean it just once one time i use it okay so and another thing is this this keyboard have three color light pink second light pink a little bit brighter than that and then a darker pink and you can make it um flickering or something i don't i will not call it flickering it's more like from the dim to the light color or you don't have color at all or make it a little bit bright kind of i will just show you okay first of all when you buy this one they will give you a manual so i have this manual over here because i don't remember okay so let's see there is a lot of function and i've tried all of it and it's work so i'm not gonna show it to you but then if you buy it it's exactly as this one it's work really work so um first of all we will go is um fn and then oh, i cannot fn and then press tab this color i hate this color so that's why i don't use this color at all and the second one uh it's acceptable but i don't like much i prefer this color a little bit pastel pink pastel actually i want to buy a blue keyboard but then they don't sell such option it's not like i hate pink it's cute it's nice but i love blue more so never mind about that so if you want to change how the keyboard gonna look like after this just fn tab you can see the back background of the keyboard also change see and i prefer this one more so if you want to change other than that you can just press fn and then press escape button from the dim to the light and then dim again and light again like a fantasy kind of thing and then press fn and escape again if you want to switch it off you will got this kind of thing it's nice already by the way you know it's already nice gosh my flu i keep having a flu oh my god i'm sorry and then fn and then you can click escape again it's a little bit dim of the pink and you can make it bright or make it like i told you just now and then switch it off again make it like this and make it the way i want 
Ta-da! So we finished this one. So we will should go with the next session by reviewing the mouse. I will tell you about the mouse after this. Wait a minute. Since we finished with the kitty pot, we're gonna go with the mouse, but then put it away, put it aside. And if you're curious where you can get this cute pad, meow pad, you can get from Shopee still. I will give you the link. I thought I already put it in the YouTube before, but then never mind about that. You can get it over there. Uh, ignore this dark spot because I did something last time and I forgot to put water on it. So here is the mouse. Um, as you can see, this is the color. It's so nice. It has a DPI also, and this is like a forward button, and this is like backward button. You can change it. Maybe I don't change it. Uh. Other than that, if you want to change anything, you just have to install. I will give you the link for the installer. You have actually to go to the uh, Onikuma website for that one and install that one. Yes, um, it will change. You can change the color from here if you want. Like you press this one and then do something with the next button. But I don't like that kind of option. So I would prefer another option. Wait, I will show you after this. Uh, it doesn't want to open somehow. I don't know why. Wait a minute. So I have opened Onikuma a headset already. So, but that's not what I want. Okay, we got it now. Okay, so um, here it is. It will show you like this. Um, maybe because this is a Chinese language or something. So you just go to the English. And it will show you um, everything over here to be honest. Oh, wait a minute. It's supposed to be something over here. Yesterday there is something. So maybe like a bug or something. But never mind about that. You don't have to worry about that. So... You can use office mode or or uh, game mode, but I prefer game mode. And you can go to the advanced for that. Like if you play uh, Minecraft or something in another server that doesn't allow double click speed, my friend said that uh, you have to remove it to 6, you know, and then just click apply. Um, and if you want to change the DPI, you can change from the way I said before. Press this button and then from the back. But then, I know I'm not going to do that one. But then you can do by changing it to this one. You just choose, you know, which one you want. But then don't forget to click apply over here. But then the color will be this yellow color. I will show you by going to this one. Wait, no, I'm sorry. By going to the light. So, going to the light, there is some option here. If I click on DPI and then click apply, it will go back to the the color that uh from the DPI one, which is yellow, the highest one. Okay, but then I don't want this color. So you just have to go back to the light again and then if you do it waltz it's gonna do it's gonna be like this. Can you see it clearly? So I don't want waltz also. Uh so we change to multicolor and then click apply so it's gonna be like this I also don't want this one so we change to four season where is it I couldn't see <laughs> four season and then click apply it's gonna be like this it's quite nice I know it's already nice this one but I don't want four season like this 
for a while we did i use four season or what i don't think i use four season so next step is change it to rainbow and then click apply so it's gonna be like this gosh this is so hard by holding it like this but i don't want this one so if you want to switch it off also you can just click off and then click apply and then it will be off but i don't want that one so the one that i've been using is flow light so click apply on it there you got it this is the one that i've been using uh, all this time so that's it regarding the keyboard so if you want to change the dpi or something just download the manual i mean not i mean the drive the driver which i will put it in the link so it will be easy for you because i got confused also last time how to download that one so finish for today regarding mouse we will go with the headset okay it's quite hard to hold on this one because of the stand is not with me so uh, i don't know where my sis putting it uh, anyway so uh, this keyboard is quite long with this kind of cable sturdy one right it's long and then oh wait a minute it's down here so it have a um volume button over here i don't remember wait yeah uh, increase the volume through here or decrease the volume and then we have a a mute button like if you want to mute your mic without clicking on the discord or any game on the mic kind of thing and then this is to switch off the light and switch it on again so that's it for the basic one so you know the basic already you just plug in and everything you can use already so basically this is how it look like you know a cat headphone cheap version but after i've been using this for three days i would not recommend you to buy this one if you have a big head and if you not comfortable much and if you have extra money i would say if you want a pink color uh, get something from a fantech or something i don't remember how to pronounce that one because okay the reason why i will tell you after this but yeah indeed it is cute you can remove it by the way but i want to keep it this way because it is a cat version and it's so cute like if you wear this one um and uh the second thing is it's actually squishy okay i don't say that it is not soft at all it is it just because of this is too tight on the head it's not gonna be comfortable for you but if you don't have enough money this is one of it and you want the pink color also right but there is another one which is uh, more cheaper than this but then yeah you can try that one but this is the one that i bought so i cannot really change to the new one yet because like uh, i just recently bought this one right so you should not waste money on that one <laughs> I will buy it when this one, this earmuff change or something. But I got a warranty for this. So, I guess I will be using this one for too long. If I'm going to buy a new one, I might give this one with the warranty to my sister. Because she likes to do TikTok video and kind of thing. And that time, she might go to some college or something. At least she can use it still pretty. But I don't think she will use this one. No, no, no. I, I might not give it this one to her because it's gonna hurt her head either i resell it or i give it to my brother which he don't mind because he has a small head by the way so back to the topic so this is how the light supposed to be and this is left and then this is right and this is the brand of the I mean, the model if i'm not wrong for the for this headphone headphone onikuma k9 so i search in the web store if they have the version where there is a ring on top of it like it's connected to here and to here which basically my old headphone have 
and it's so comfortable that one but then the the above is like it's already broken kind of thing i can change that one but i don't find which store yet and also for the earmuff it's already um uh, like old kind of thing i can remove the earmuff i mean the this thing from the old headphone but it's black headphone not pink color also so yeah what i want to say again <laughs> this is soft also but one again once more time i tell you that it's not gonna be comfortable on your head because it's way too tight. Please get something from Fantec. Okay. F-A-N-T-E-C-H. Something like that. And search for 7.1. Because 7.1 have the option for USB. I forgot to mention you this one. This is the USB version. I don't prefer to buy the 3.5 jack kind of thing. Because my laptop doesn't support that one. Like it can. But then the noise will still come inside. I don't know why. And I'm lazy to fix on that one because it's going to cost money or something. I don't know. I don't know anything about laptop or computer or anything like that. So, uh, if you need another version of this one, go get Fantac 7.1. The volume inside, 7.1 volume, you know. So, it will give you the uh, that headphone have a, a extension kind of thing. And it's not going to be like this. It's going to be a soft one over here, like... like uh, you can move it also like when you put your head it will move with you you know instead of hard uh, plastic like this and tight that one is way more nicer oh my god it's already five minutes i talk about that one only because i am really sad with the way how it is like i thought it's gonna be comfortable but then i forgot that they don't have this thing above here and it it is a solid one over here so it's gonna hurt you but then yeah it's nice it's really nice if you want a cute one yes yeah, sure and regarding the mic you can do it like this or you can put it back inside when you don't use it and yeah uh, and also you still can uh, people can still hear you even if you put it inside here and when you record i suggest that you switch off a fan if you have your fan and it will not really uh, catch the noise if you have this one. Oh, wait a minute. My flu coming back again. I don't know why it keeps coming back. So, uh, switch off your fan if you have a fan. Uh, if you want to record your voice singing or anything, like I said. If you have aircon, it would be a perfect place for you to record. If not, no fan. And I'm sweaty AF right, right now trying to record this one without having a noise from my ceiling fan. I'm sorry for my flu. I don't know why. When I, I think I have an allergy, like, like a mixing of things, you know. Because when it's hot, I don't have a flu. But then when it's mixed with something like uh for example coal plus with dust you will get flu but then when it's, it's only cold you will not get flu that kind of thing it's quite annoying like i read uh i saw on youtube this girl she don't have a problem with eating prawn but then because of she eating prawn and then she directly go to the um jogging her face have a, a lot of allergy reaction like you really the face are so bad like uh, a spot of red everywhere so it's an allergy by the way it's if you cannot figure out where your allergy come from you better check it soon i i think i have to check mine also but i don't know if it's allergy or maybe because i'm still sick yeah so i want to show you the mic sound but i guess if you uh next few days if i record my voice or, or something like that you can check it from there wait a minute i do record yesterday video and yesterday yesterday also the video that's how i sound from this mic it's clear and it's way too loud by the way this one i told you this this headset give you a 
really loud volume and you cannot hear from the outside if you put it in a high volume my dad kind of scold me last night they came back around 4 a.m like that i don't remember 4 to 3 a.m and then she, he's not really scolding me he's just nagging at me how i didn't hear them knocking the door i really don't hear anything because of this thing so if you have a bad ears please not wear this for too long and reduce the volume and don't wear it for too long because of it is tight like i told you just now i guess that's all for me today that's all nothing else regarding this one i don't really like this uh, headset but yeah it can move like this only that one that one just a little bit only and then just uh the re you can resize it uh, based on your head also but other than that i would not recommend you to buy this one seriously it's not gonna comfortable for you it's it's cute but it's gonna hurt you trust me on this one unless if you have a small head or you have a, s a soft head i don't know but then i will really 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 not recommend this one uh, but the keyboard is nice and so the mouse but not this one okay i guess that's all for my review so i have to put it over here again because the head uh the that thing is not with me right now so yeah so this is how it's gonna be i'm just gonna put it over here and then uh, my, my setup is simple it's quite messy that's why with my medicine of clothes that one <laughs> and some vitamin over there and some uh glass cleaner kind of thing and my panda coin panda and there is a pushing earbud or earphone and then my wallet and i didn't close this one and and this is like actually a small book where i bought a lot of it by the way actually i bought that for dictionary kind of thing but then like i'm counting money on this one also supposed to use for dictionary kind of thing when i learn new word you know but then oh my god see there is a telugu over there but then i didn't even use for that and this is my brother minecraft thing i don't know hot wheel or something i don't remember wait yeah it's hot wheel hot wheel brand it's a minecraft thing uh and the cubic also from him I don't know why this pushing is over here i supposed to have my bluetooth over here my bluetooth speaker but then my brother he took it to watch a um anime so yeah and i have another one which is my brother also and i used to stalk <laughs> people using this one when i was a student like it's fine okay i didn't do weird thing okay just yeah just looking at another hostel room okay i know it's wrong but then i didn't see anything other than uh the building so don't worry about that um so yeah that's the setting that i have this this is the thing this all <coughs> yeah wait yeah this is this is all not really nice i know that see This flu really buzzer me. Oh my god. I don't know why. I have to switch it on again. The fan. Okay. So I guess that's all for today. See you next time. Bye bye.